Ganun. Ganun. Dito nga kay Ate Pia, banda. Ayan. Amesians, magingay! Magandang, magandang, magandang walang hapon this summer break, Amesians! This, this is, is Ames Live, Live Season 4, Episode 4! For the task tayo ng energy ngayon ka na. Siyempre, need natin mag energetic sa intro. Siyempre, isa, ako may hawak ng mic dito eh. So, dahil for sure ang mga ancients lang naman ay nakastrive na sa ating katatapos na finals examination. I couldn't agree more, Ken. Kaya naman, deserve na deserve ng mga Asians ang mag-sit back, relax, and enjoy. Enjoy much, partner. Ah. No, ang dami mong masyadong tulog ngayon na. Ah. Well, Alam mo, tamang behavior yan kasi isipin mo, after a month full of activities, biglang transition to examination. Kaya we really, really, really deserve ang mag-relax-relax muna, partner. Tama ka dyan, Ken. Kaya ano pang hinihintay natin? Tara, simulan na natin ang exciting part. Kaya naman, ready ka na ba? Ready, ready na! Ikaw ba, partner? G ka na ba? Sabi mo, G ka na. Ito ay may pa-surprise quiz ako sa'yo, Ken. Wow, wow, partner. Ba bago to, ah. Surpri medyo surprising. Pero hindi ba pwede... Kaya surprise quiz, Ken, oh, oh, eh. Surprising sorry, talaga sorry, sorry, yan. Ahead. Well, pwede bang magpahinga muna ako saglit? Kahit saglit lang. Mga ah, ganyan. Ah, pwede na, pwede na. Partner. Okay, so ang bilis. Ready na ako sa quiz. Ready ang bilis mo kausap ka na. Okay, sabi mo, ready ka na. Yes. Ito yung una kong katanungan, Ken. So, matetest natin dito kung gano'ng katalino yung brain o kung gano'ng kataas yung MB ng brain ni Ken. Ito na unang katanungan. <laughs> okay, so the term itself refers specifically to a singular male graduate. Ano ba yan? yan, yan Kala ko naman masyado kang nag-prepare, parang di naman. <laughs> Dali masyado. Siyempre, ang sagot dyan ay alumnus. Wow! Napaka-brain nila ko nalagay ni Ken. Manang-mana sa akin. Okay, so alumnus yung sagot mo. Piling ko matalino nga ako, medyo naglalag ka partner ngayon eh. Ayan. Well, so, ano tanong mo, ano ulit? Ayan nga. So, tama yung sagot mo na alumnus yung sagot doon sa um, term na specifically para sa singular male graduate. Ito naman, Ken. Paano naman kapag ka plural form? <laughs> eh di alumni, ano, may babato ka pa ba? Baka pwede na itong sabato, sige ni babato. Masyado ka namang, ano, masyado ka namang, ano, marahas partner. Hindi porket eh, month nyo nga yung mga babae. Pwede mo na akong ganyan-ganyan eh. Ayan, no, Iris, sige, baba mo pa yan, Iris. Ayan, parang feeling ko may gusto ka pang sabihin sa akin. Itaas mo yan, Iris. Yan, actually, nakaka-catch up na si Iris. Medyo mataas din yung MB ng brain niya. 
Ayan, so anyways, wala, wala man akong surprise quiz, pero meron naman akong inahandang trivia about sa mga alum-alum mo. Wow! Sige nga, impress us ka yun. Pakita mo kung gano'ng kataas yung MB ng brain mo. Well, sinabi mo kanina, ang singular form ng lalaking graduate ay alumnus. Yes. While the plural form, na, <laughs> while the plural form naman ay alumni. Meron din sa mga babae, alam mo ba yun, partner? Actually, alam ko yan, pero di ako sure. Sige. Oo, uh, oh, di ako sure. Sige ko to, huwag mo agawin. Ah, sige, no. <laughs> well, siyempre, ang singular form ng female graduates ay tinatawag na alumna. Siyempre, well, sabi sa script. Tapos? Huwag mo akong anuhin. Ay, sorry, sorry. Well, pag plural form naman ay alumne. Anong spell? Alam mo ba? Oh, hindi Ayon. mo alam. Ako na. Yun nga. A-L-U-M-N-A-E, partner, ha? Ah, okay. So, paano yun naman kapag uh, bakit tinatawag na alumni kahit na may babae? Kapag, siyempre, kapag alumni naman, ano siya, ginagamit kasi siya pag general term. Okay. Parang gender, gender yeah, neutral. Yes, tama. Gen, okay. gen, ano, gender neutral naman kapag alumni. Okay, yan sinasabi. So, partner, anong masasabi mo may inahanda akong trivia? Ayan, good thing you asked, partner. Go, sabihin mo na sa akin yan. Masyado ka talagang naglalag, no? Uh-oh, yeah, well, good thing you asked, syempre. Yun nga, sabi ko, gender neutral siya. na most na makikita natin siya sa lahat ng mga kunyari events lagi ginagamit is alumni. Wait, mm. teka-teka, bakit naman tayo napupunta sa mga ganyan tanong? At medyo napapalayo na tayo, partner. Bakit yung ba usapan natin yan? Actually, partner, hindi tayo napapalayo. Kasi as you can remember, yung last episode natin, our institution, no, the AIMS, uh, invited our alumni, sabi mo nga, para sa babae at lalaki na term, Gender neutral. Gender neutral, sorry. Ayan, so for their homecoming na ginanap noong last March for partner. At meron din tayo naging guest na alumni din. Mm, tatlo sila. Yes, tatlo sila. No? Sila Miss Angelica Lomakang, Coach Norman Pangilinan, and last but not the least, syempre, si Miss Aline Rabehe. Yes, partner. So, oo nga, no, partner. You know what, partner? It's really nice na bumuo yung institution, yung AIMS mismo, ng homecoming for their beloved grad family. Kasi, what a nice thing to look back from your roots and somewhat feels the nostalgia behind it wow. on what it feels like to be a part of a college institution. Wow, napaka! Grabe naman yan, Ken! You lost me pagkasabi mo agad ng nostalgia. So, speaking of nostalgia, pakispell nga. Ako, ang dami mo naman tanong sa akin, partner. <laughs> Tama na yan. Let's move forward na. So, okay. So, partner, did you know wow. the Ames Blue Shark naman Ames Blue Shark men's basketball team bags their first win against SDCA during their opening match at the NCRA 2023 season. The mighty Amesians finished the games with a 3 points lead, 80 versus 77. Ayan, partner, so bigyan natin sila ng glimpse of what happened sa NCRAA na nanalo ang ating Ames Basketball. Roll DDR!
We got what you looking for. We got what you looking for. We got what you looking for. Let's go, Blue Shark! Yeah. Grabe, partner. No, to think na sobrang dikit ng laban. Well, baka aims yan. Agree. At syempre, 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 nagpakitang gilas din ang mga ancients na lumahok sa PSA CE. CA or PAXA Convention with the delegates from different universities including ng Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao. So basically, partner, it is a national convention. National convention? Yes, wait, wait. partner. So napakabigat pala nito, no? Bigat ang event talaga, partner, dahil alam mo kung saan ito ginanap. Saan? Grabe, sa teacher's camp lang naman sa Baguio noong March 8 to 11. Baguio, napakamig naman dun, partner. Yes, ha? partner. Also, may I add na our very own Amesians were selected to represent NCR partner for TikTok Mr. Pax sa poster making and singing contest. Grabe talaga ang tatak Amesians, di ba? Partner. Well, sino-sino ba sila? Well, sila Piolo Pas... Ano, Piolo... Pas <laughs> wow! Grabe <laughs> na lang talaga. Ang bigatin. Medyo kawig kasi, partner. Siya yung nilaban sa ano? Mr. Paxa. Mr. Paxa, yes. Shoutout kay Piolo Samson. Yan. Yeah. Well, si Piolo Samson, Dominic San Pascual, our compass writer, ha? Cassandra Ivan Ortega. Wow. Makita nga natin ito mamaya eh. Oo nga, partner. Parang well, bigatin. Yan. Sunod naman si Yasmin Kate Dizon. And last, our... Our friend, yes, Jan our Franz dear friend, yes, our John Francis Santelis is ang inilaban. Like, hello, sila na to. Mga award winners ng Ancients na, hello. Tumpak ganun, partner, at itinanghal naman na third runner-up si midshipman Dominic Sampasqual sa singing contest. Grabe naman talaga, ay! Congratulations, Congratulations po! Your, your Ames family, family is, is so proud, proud of you. Ahem, basa lubong! Ayan, ikaw naman, Ken. Ayan nga, diba? Ayan. Ayan nga, may video nga akin. Ito naman. Let's play the video, <laughs> please. Grabe yung mga representative natin from Ames, no? Huh, mga talented talaga at mga pogit magaganda. Kaya as well, in ayong pasalubong nyo, guys. Yes, partner. Parang naka-early ano na sila, no? Early vacation ba? Ay, nakalamang Ay, sila sa atin. Nakalamang. So, speaking of... Ayan nga, partner. Speaking of vacation, since this is the first week ng SEM break natin, Ames, ikaw, partner, nung balak mo this SEM break, partner? Give us something new. Wow. Well, wow. Hindi naman okay. sa pagmamayabang, eh, magbivisit kami sa ano, New Zealand from the high mountains grassland. Rorol nyo lang ako sa ano, sa damo-damo kasama ng mga baka, kumbaga. Ha? Kasi baka ka rin or kambing ka? Hindi, hindi. Ah, hindi naman doon. Medyo ano, tao lang naman ako. Ah, okay. Ay, sorry, sorry. Ay, sorry, sorry. Ay, sorry, sorry. Ay, sorry, sorry. naman. Ayan, part. Ako ba? Hindi mo ako tatanungin. Eh, ano, eh, dyan ka lang naman sa bahay mo. Oh, ah, partner. Sige, saan ka ba? Ayan, bibisitahin ko lang kasi yung tito ko kasi matagal ko na rin siya hindi nakakasama kasi nga um, medyo malayo siya. So yung tito ko nga pala, hello si tito ko kay Elon Musk. Um, sasakay lang kami sa space. Ta um, mag <laughs> mag <laughs> ano yung gagawin natin doon sa space? Ano, mag-ikot-ikot lang ata kami around the earth or titingin-tingin lang kami sa uh, around ano, the solar ano, system. Ba? Ba, pwede mo naman akong... Medyo ano lang. lang um, low key, low key. Low key lang yung ano namin, uh, trip namin this time break part. Uh, Ayun lang naman. Well, so much chika na tayo rito, Dana. Kaya naman, tumungo na tayo sa next segment na kung saan eh, napupunta lang naman tayo sa iba't ibang parte ng Ames Campus. Ayan, partner, no, sinabi natin last time sa episode natin, da, baka nasa bubong na tayo wait, ng wait, Ames. Medyo malapit na sa bubong, partner. Medyo malapit na ba? Eh. Ano kung baga, kisame na. Kisame. Kaya pala. So, partner, ano na ba ang next segment natin? Ito ang... Where, Where we at? at? Well, to answer your question, uh, kung nasa niya ba tayo, eh napapansin nyo, eh nadito tayo sa Joe Auditorium. Tingnan nyo, oh, hello. Parang mala ano eh. Mala. Cinema. Yes. yes. Cinema vibe yung ano. 
Tama nga, Ken, no, nasa, malapit na tayo sa bubong. So, medyo nasa kisame na tayo. To partner, uh, to give uh, people naman about trivia, about dito sa Joa, no, it was named after Madam Jane Ofe Maria Buwed, one of the pillars of the institution. Wow! Ika, ikaw naman ang may trivia ngayon, yes, partner. Yes, partner. Ha? Syempre, hindi ako magkapala mang sa'yo, no? Mm, yes! Charing. Ayan, partner, sinabi ko nga na medyo malapit na tayo sa bubong or nasa kisame na tayo dahil nasa 12 deck lang naman tayo or 12th floor tayo ng Ames Tower partner. Ang lakas! Maka-graduation feels! Ayan, partner. Ano na? <laughs> yes, partner. Malapit-lapit naman na tayo anyways dito sa... Kung saan lang naman dito ginaganap yung gawad para nga lahat marami pang iba't ibang big events. Yes, partner. Mga prestigious at mga bigating events talaga. And... Okay, it's time to move on na, Ken. Para sa ating next segment, eto, Ken, na. Alam ko itong inaabangan ng mga viewers natin dyan. Dahil, ito na, ito na. Ito ang Guess to Win! So, so, ito na nga. For today's video, magkakaroon tayo ng two winners na mananalo ng 200 pesos. True, Jigas! <laughs> all you have to do. Ganon sobrang kataas yung energy niya. <laughs> well, all you have to do is answer our questions of the day and send your answers to our live comment sections. Na makikita niyo sa Gilad. Yes, our team will pick two winners from all the correct answers for today. Ganon lang kadalek. Kaya naman tutok lang for a chance to win 200 pesos through Gcash. Well, well Ayan. para well, masagot well. nila yan. Ha? Ito yung mechanics. Kailangan siyempre ilagay niyo yung sagot. Then after that, you have to input your MS Teams name and your student number. And also, don't forget our hashtag for today. Our hashtag for today is we can be equal with a capital A L L as an all. Yan. Ayan, guys. So kung narinig niyo na yung mechanics natin, uh, i-send din yan sa live comment section ng aming mga team kung ano yung mechanics. At tumungo na tayo, syempre, sa ating unang katanungan, Ken. Ayan, para sa unang katanungan natin, sino ang nanalo sa ginanap na pack sa competition sa Baguio sa larangan ng singing contest? Ulit, ulit, ulit. Nag-inalit ako. Saan ulit? Ayan, ulitin ko nun sa mga kajo-join lang po ng aming live stream. Ito po ang aming unang katanungan. So, sino ang nanalo na aims sa ginanap na pack sa competition sa Baguio sa larangan ng singing contest? Ayan, malay mo, ikaw na pala ang susunod na nanalo. Kaya ano pang hinihintay mo? Mag-comment ka na! Partner, partner, partner. Habang hinihintay natin ang mga sagot ng ating live viewers for today, eh, sa unang tanong, yes. So, magtungo na muna tayo sa ating next segment na talaga namang inaabangan ng ating mga viewers. Ito ang... Ginalingan! Baka aims yan! So, in nga, partner, this episode is about Women's Month. You know, the celebration of being what does a woman mean. Well, partner, para sa'yo talaga yung script na yan. Kasi isipin mo, babae ka. Oh, babae bala. <laughs> well, well, yes, partner. Well, tell us about what does it mean to be a woman in your own perspe perspective. Ayan nga, partner. First of all, syempre, it celebrates the highlights of women's achievements and discuss continuing and emerging women's empowerment and gender equality issues concerning challenges and commitment. Ayan nga, partner, no, uh, yung sinaselebrate natin for this month, lalong-lalo na uh, as a woman, no, um, para lang ma-embrace no, at matandaan talaga ng babae na it is... It is our time at alam natin nung kaya natin gawin kung ano man yung mga challenges na uh, kinakaharap natin in whatever um, discipline they are in or kung ano man sector sila naroon, naniniwala kami as a woman na naniniwala kami that you can do better. Yes. Ayan. Speaking of equality issues and challenges, partner, narinig ko sa sinabi mo kanina eh. Well, unti lang yung alam ko as a man na about sa si women. Pero, what I know from history, kasi meron ako na base nung nag-article search search wow. lang ako sa FM nun dati. Well, nung ano, isipin mo ah, napaka ano, na medyo late yung Pilipinas noon sa ano, sa pag-upgrade sa process sa 
ano, eh, ano, embracing the power of women. Kasi isipin mo, ha, 1910, nagsimula yung movement para yung mga Filipino women ay makaboto. Then, isipin mo, after 27 years, nung 1937 lang siya, ano, pwede legally makaboto yung mga babae. So, isipin mo, ha, halos mag ano ni, mag one century ni, no? Isipin mo, kung saan na tayo ngayon, isipin mo kung lahat kasi ngayon ng babae, pwede na rin magtrabaho ng kahit ano, like, ano, men's job. Like, for example, sa sarili kong course, dati, yung BSMT is, ano lang siya, male-dominated male course siya, kung saan is usually yung kailangan lalaki. Pero ngayon, isipin mo, 2023, kaklasik ko nga ngayon, halos 10 kung tama, 10 or 11 kami mag- uh, 10, and 10 and 11 na mga babae sa room ko. Ayan, partner. So, syempre, nasa course mo na rin ako. Hindi na tayo lalayo pa. Pero, syempre, partner, para mas maintindihan natin yung, or mag-grasp talaga natin kung ano ba yung importance or significance, kung bakit natin sineselebrate yung Women's Month. Syempre, meron tayong mga special guests. Pero, syempre, bago ang lahat, partner, para sa ating guest to win, no, balik lang tayo. No? Kasi, i-discuss na natin or ibigay na natin yung pangalawang katanungan natin. natin. O, oh, isagad na natin. Para isang na lang. Yes, partner, and fourth chance, again, to win 200 pesos through GCash. Ito na, guys. Ang pangalawang tanong, saan ginaganap ang ating lives sa mga oras na ito? Sumulitin ko, partner. Ayan, ulitin mo nga, partner. Ayoko. Ah, sige, wag na lang. <laughs> Hindi, joke lang. Sorry. So, saan ginaganap ang ating lives sa mga oras na ito? Ayan. Ayan. So, kumpleto na yung questions for the day natin. Kaya i-comment nyo na guys ha. Ito na, binaba na namin kasi alam nyo kung bakit meron tayong guest na talagang mabibigat. Eh, yes. sorry, pangit ng pagkaka-input uh -huh. ng word. Meron tayong mga bigating guest na inimbita para sa mga ancients para mas lalo nilang maunawaan sa tungkol ang Women's Month at para ganahan na lumawak sila sa ating mga questions of the week. Yes, partner. Sobra excited talaga ako. Kaya naman, tawagin na natin ang ating mga guests for today's episode. That will enlighten us on what does Women's Month is all about. Ken, pakilala mo na! Well, let's welcome. all welcome our first guest. Uh, we have midship woman Jennifer Di Ocampo. Well, sino ba yun? Ayan, sino ba si Ma'am Jennifer? Sino ba si Ma'am Jennifer Di Ocampo? Well, kung di nyo matatanong, siya, kaklasiko siya ngayon sa eight, ano, last semester, nung second sem. Kaklasiko siya. <laughs> Pa-ulit ulit ka naman, partner. Wait, wait lang, well. <laughs> so, ano kaklasiko siya? Yes. Eto pa, isa siyang student council president. Wow, yes. Isa din siyang peer Okay. Facilitator, right? Yes. Peer facilitator group. Kasama din siya sa, ano, officer sa CSFD. Wow. Isipin mo, napakadami, napaka-busy person naman itong kagama natin. So, mag-good afternoon. Good hello. afternoon. Hello. Mag-body ka po muna sa ating mga live viewers, ma'am. Hi, Aim Shans. Well, Ayan. if di nyo natatanong, eh, birthday niya kahapon, baka gusto nyo naman, ano, batiin. Ayan, I'm no belated. Ayan, ba belated. Batiin nyo, guys. <laughs> Hoy, makinig kayo well. Hoy, batiin nyo ang ating guest. Belated happy birthday po. Thank you, ka. Thank you po. Okay, so next on our yes, guest, guest. Uh, we have also our, how do I put this? Uh, isa siya sa writer, uh, isa siyang writer sa yes. org na to, sa The Compass. And also, sumali lang naman siya sa Mr. and Ms. Ames. Ambassador for yes. this year. Isa siya sa mga finalists. Yes. Well, syempre, malamang nakita nyo na to sa Entoblado na tumutula kung saan talaga ipinapaiyak tayo sa kanyang mga piyesa na inihanda. Sinasaktan tayo. Yes, diba? partner. So, let, let us all welcome Miss Cassandra Yvonne Ortega. Ayan. So, bati po Ayan. muna kayo, Miss Ortega. Hello po. Good afternoon. And ayun, Ken, no, siyempre, hindi, hindi na tayo magpapatumpik-tumpik pa. Siyempre, ipapakilala na natin at isa sa pinakabigating guest natin. Well, get, well ano ha, partner, humingahinga ka muna ng malalim kasi medyo mahaba ang yung sasabi. Yes, Ken. partner, sobrang dami kasi achievement ng next guest natin at sobrang nakaka-inspire as a wow, woman talaga. talaga. So, aayos muna ako na upuan yes, ko, partner. Ken, My kasi siyempre, Kailang... bigatin to, Ken, eh. Kailangan hinit-formal tayo at maayos natin ipapakilala. Um, she is an alumna of the BSCA Batch 2004, a consultant of the Coffrold Formworks and Scaffolds 
President of RV19 Engineering Services, Macbeo Cargo International Group of Companies Incorporation, and Shembre Licensed Customs Broker, and meron siya iba pakilala mamaya. So, tawagin na natin si Ms. Rochelle Gamba! Good afternoon, ma! Good afternoon, ma! Good afternoon, everybody! Wow, sobrang ganda! Sobrang bigate naman yun! Ang kinakabahan ako! <laughs> Nakatabi ko si ma'am. Ayun, ma'am, baka may gusto po kayong batiin ngayon. Good All afternoon right. po. Good afternoon, everyone! It's okay na. Hello, Aim Shan! And hello, everyone! who's here in our AIMS live and my live and blessing to you everybody. Um, well, eventually, I would like to say gratitude and thank you to all those who, those, my friends and my mentors who also give their insights about our topic. This is actually mahaba-haba sila, but I would like to take this opportunity, guys. Yeah, go, go, um, to give gratitude, blessing, of course, to my mom. Hi, Mama! <laughs> Ardinda Macabeo, my mentors, um, Sandy Martinez, KL Desera Agustin, Shina Maulion, the whole Blessing Lives and Building Dreams, my family, of course, here and around the world, um, Ma'am Mary Ann Omega, um, Sir Noel Omega, Sir Ace Aguilar, and also Doc Risa Caldoza. Maraming maraming salamat sa inyo guys. My sister in Christ as well, Jennifer Nuya. Um, Nika Fortune, uh, one of my, I really admire this woman. And there's a lot of saying my gratitude to all my my mentors my friends my blessing lives and building dreams business community my synergy family and um my profession as well maraming maraming salamat po Ayan po ma'am. So parang maraming maraming salamat po. No? First of all, syempre sa time nyo na ibinigay po sa amin. Napakaganda ni ma'am. Kung nakikita nyo lang talaga ng live, sobrang ganda ni ma'am. At syempre, na-intimidate kami sa sobrang, yung, alam nyo yun, yung presence partner. Actually ma'am, let me correct you lang ma'am. Kasi I think, ano, mas blessing pa sa amin ma'am na kayo yung guest namin ma'am ngayon. Yes, we will be blessed by your wisdom and your experience ma'am. And you know, as a woman, maraming maraming salamat po. You're such an inspiring ma'am sa amin. Alam mo partner, ah, medyo to be honest, na-intimidate to think about it ah. Kasi talaga napapalibutan ako ngayon ng mga powerful women. Ay, woman, sorry. <laughs> yes, well, partner. Ayan, ayan so, mababa yung MB ng brain ayan, mo, partner ayan, ha? Ayan, well, hinan, may hinandalang naman kaming questions for you to answer. So, ang so, mangyayari po is Mag-question po kami, then isa-isa po niyong sasagutin. Papasa po. Yes. So, sisimulan po natin kay Cassandra Yvonne Ortega. So, the first question is, how do you empower yourself, yourself ah, and women around you? Well, thank you for that wonderful question. Wow! Oh, Mas mga pageant! <laughs> well, first of all, kasi since I'm an advo advocate of gender equality, and also we all know that uh, I'm part of the LGBTQ plus community, so I empower myself by being a voice of my own self and also a voice to other people. Kasi uh, even bisexual people, we celebrate Women's Month. Because kahit naman bisexual ka, uh, you still have a heart as a woman and also around me parang i empower them by being uh their selves kung paano ko pinapakita na kaya ko as a bisexual kailangan maipakita ko sa kanila na kaya rin nila and they can handle yung sarili din naman nila so ayan ayan very so. well put Yes, actually, na-lost na ako na, Charing, kasi sobrang grabe yung pagkaka-answer niya, parang pang pageant na pageant talaga. Actually, well-trained. Alam mo, to, to be honest, may brave out, may pagka-brave doon kasi you're, ano eh, you're putting yourself, ano, vulnerable on cam. You're uh, coming yeah. out. Kaya, to be honest, I'm proud of you, ha, Cassandra Yvonne Ortega, also my friend. So, next question naman sa'yo. Um... <laughs> parang, parang ano lang, tambay lang tayo dito. O sa'yo, ikaw na yung susunod na asagot. Eh. <laughs> Ayan, ma'am, Miss President. 
Ayan. So, how do you empower yourself and also the people, especially the women around you, ma'am? So, I empower myself just being myself because it takes a long time para mabuild ko yung sarili ko and makilala yung sarili ko. So, ako as ako na confident and I empower other people by supporting them verbally. Like, pinipraise ko sila para sila din meron sila magkaroon sila ng confidence sa sarili nila as well. Ayan. So, parang affirmative si ma'am, no? So, parang verbal. Yung pag, uh, yun yung way niya to empower women. So, maraming maraming salamat, ma'am. And syempre po, kay ma'am Rich, ayan, how do you empower po yourself and especially the women around you, ma'am? Thank you. Thank you very much. And actually, this is offered to everybody and to my mentors as well, my friends in Facebook, my social media, and to AIMS, of course. So, actually, I have this. I don't really wanted to miss any single word. So, I have my, uh, my script. And thank you to my community. Really a gratitude to, to everyone. So, make yourself, make yourself sufficient. And lead by example. So, seek to contribute instead of being dependent. Having a personal goal is really a key. Ang taong, sabi nga, di ba? Ang taong walang direction sa buhay, nagiging pabigat lang sa iba. So, it's really all about yourself, your heart, your brain, your living life or purpose. So, especially nowadays, um, you would agree na there's a lot of things that we need to be grateful for. Yes, you know, even the world right now could give a positive or negative, but it's simply, it's all about you. So, empower ourselves with our personal goals and values. Wow. So, para na lulubog na ako dito. Pero sabi, grab, grabe yung, yung inspiring words ni Ma'am, no? Na make yourself sufficient. Para... Talaga magsisimula talaga sa sarili mo, eh. Your inner self is the key for improving your own self and to be able to influence others. Ayan, kasi magradiate talaga yun, partner, no? Na if you're really confident and you're sufficient within yourself, kayang-kaya mong i-empower din yung other women. Especially just by your actions lang, eh. Just by your words. Kayang-kaya mong maka-influence ng other people, especially the women around you. And, syempre, balik tayo, no? Meron tayong follow-up question for them. So, mag-sort naman tayo kay Miss Jen. Ayan. So, ma'am,
Parker, no? So, nag-flash lang tayo ng screen kung ano nangyari dun sa alumni homecoming. Last four, uh, 4th of March. And partner. Sipi mo kung na doon tayo, no? Feeling ko talaga nag-enjoy din tayo. Siguro feeling ko after ilang years siguro. Uh, mga ano ka na? Mga 32. Eh, mga gurangin ka na. <laughs> Pero mararanasan din natin yan balang araw. Yes, partner. So, balik na tayo. Siyempre, mag-focus tayo. Sabi nga nila, ma'am, uh, ni Ma'am Rich, no? ni Kakay, and ni Ma'am Jen kanina. Hanapin natin yung ano, kunin natin yung takeaway natin to their own answer. Ayan, sige. Mauna ka na, partner. Ang akin takeaway is from Miss Yvonne Ortega is, ano, yung, ano, alam mo yun, yung parang... Hindi ko pa alam yun. Sige, go. Wala mo. <laughs> Akala mo dyan, ha? Well, ano, it takes, ano, eh, it takes every blood from yourself to, ano, to be brave. So, kailangan talaga is, you have to be brave to encourage others. Alam mo yun, yung isipin mo to promote yourself and also your advocacy is big, no? <laughs> <laughs> yes, partner. Sobrang, actually then, napakaganda na sinabi nila, ma'am, na um, pakikipag-affirmative, no? Yung yes. verbal language lang na kahit, sab kahit sabihin mo lang sa babae na um, galingan mo yan. Kung yeah, congrats, good yun, luck, yung, di ba? Yung uso ngayon, yung queen, slay! Oh, yung ganyan, slay, di ba? Ganon, pak lang, ganon, parang oh. go lang lang go. Yeah. Pero coming from a woman kasi, iba rin yun, ayun, sa perspective ko, no? Kapag kayong compliment ay galing talaga sa woman, parang, Mas nakakadagdag po yung son. Kasi sa mga... Ayo. Hindi na nga, hindi na nga. Ano hey queen, you drop your crown. Ah, di ba? Yung mga ganon. So, sino-sino ba talaga ang mag-susuportahan? Uh, Siyempre, tayo-tayo rin. So... Wait, di ako sa kayo-kayo yun. <laughs> ayan, yung mga women, di ba? Well, kay ma'am naman, yung takeaway ko naman is, you have talaga, you have to... Mot ano, kayo, kailangan meron kang ano, goal. Para kapag ano, improve mo yung, kapag na-improve mo na yung sarili mo, then mariradiate mo nga, tama yung pagkakasabi mo sa other, yung influence ba? Mm. Ayun, partner, no? Paano ka, paano ka ba kasi makakapag-influence if you not, if yourself may lack ka pa of something? So you need to be confident about who you are, about what you can bring to the table so that you can radiate or influence the people around you. Kapag sobra-sobra na sa sayo, Ano, give it to others na naman. Share. Saka mag-overflow na lang talaga yan. Na, like, confident Actually, ka. Actually, hindi mo pa nga, hindi mo sinasadya eh. Talaga mag-overflow siya. Naturally. Wow! Naturally. Ayan, partner. <laughs> Duka ko na Moving tayo. Moving on for diba? the next okay. question. Uh, we have, what makes women socially relevant, ha, Jen? So, for me, women are always relevant in any way um, because women um, essentially contributors when it comes to workloads, um, um, decision-making process, and overall society development, and also to add up women bears child. So sila ang life giver sa society talaga. I couldn't agree more naman kay Ma'am. Ay, pasayan si Madam Jen. Oh, diba? Life giver, ganyan. <laughs> Next tayo kay Kakay. Kakay, what do you think women socially uh, relevant? So we all know naman, di ba, na uh, in our generation right now na talagang tumitindig na yung mga babae. That's why uh, relevant na sila sa society natin. And also, yung marami na tayo mga boss madam, di ba, ganun na yung tawag sa kanila. Kaya parang mas uh, relevant na sila and mas nililook up na sila sa society natin. Yeah. Yeah. So tumakulong naman tayo kay Ma'am Rich. Ma'am Rich, what makes you think women are uh, socially relevant. Ano po, paano po sila naging relevant? Yeah, that's perfect. So eventually, earlier, I al already mentioned about live a purpose-driven life. That's also one of an amazing gratitude to Ma'am Gina Bermudo. Actually, during our discussion earlier, I, I even asked them, you know, um, eventually, that's really a power of having your mentor really it's it's really a gratitude and bless having your own mentor and especially earlier na banggit nyo it's all about my my fruits because when you are are rich inside diba even a plant um let's say an apple kaya siya may bunga because sobra na siya kumbaga 
it's it's six six lig lig at umaapaw so that it really means to live a purpose purposeful life and well eventually this is also a part and thank you to Mr. and Mrs. Mary Ann Sir Noel Omega actually they have also give me um their insights about this so I uh, thank you thank you thank you very much because I will not do any of this information from their heart without them so I would like to share this so the world would stop functioning if women were irrelevant so it takes a man and a woman to create a new life therefore by design God made woman to do an equally important role as man and vice versa. So one could co one would one could not coexist without the other. Otherwise, the future of the world is doomed. So totoo nga naman. And I would rather share actually one of our talk also from one of my mentor said I'm I'm not pretty sure maybe mad, uh, mother or father nyo guys or even my friends who's joining this live I would like to share this coming from my mentor said you know guys if you husband are joining me now or listening me now you would rather pray na um ex ex excuse mo na sa word no you would rather prefer to die first before your wife. Kasi si mentor lost her wife due to this, um, pandemic. this pandemic. And sobrang hirap daw talaga nang nawala yung wife niya. So, um, it's rather from your side, if that's true or true, wala kayong choice. But for me, it's true. And it also, women have always been relevant, especially in this matriarchal country. Think of our lady president, right? So be socially relevant by having a mission instead of just trying. The word trying to be relevant. Ika nga, no? Even during my, my student life. Yan. Wag kang KSP or kulang sa pansin. So, be purpose-driven and let your actions speak louder than your voice. Ayan, partner. So, maraming maraming salamat. Grabe yung mga wordings, mga wisdoms ng mga Oo, guests grabe, natin. Grabe din talaga yung mga mentor ko and mga friends. Hello. <laughs> Hello po. Hello po. No? Shout out po sa inyo. Maraming maraming salamat so, po. So, paano ano yung takeaway mo sa this question? Actually, partner, yung women, so, ano kan ba yung relevant ng women sa social um, actually, yun, nabanggit na nila lahat. Pero siguro, um, sa perspective ko, partner, no, uh, I also have an, an NGO organization na magkakaroon kami ng, ayan, singit ka lang po, no, magkakaroon kami ng uh, women's celebration sa March 25. No? We are bringing the urban farming sa kanila para makatulong yun. And they are the mother of the um, cancer patients. So, ayun talaga yung tinutulungan namin. Uh, magkaroon sila ng other source of income and by uh, through the urban farming and together with the BPI, uh, Bureau of Plant Industry, maraming maraming salamat po. So, sa tingin ko, partner, um, sabi nga nila, di ba, um, back, uh, back then the day, uh, relevant na talaga yung women. Pero sa tingin ko, what makes really a woman um, relevant is yung contribute sila socially. Um, yung pagiging selfless ng women, Yan, alam mo yun, hindi nila tinitignan kung ano yung pangangailangan nila, but they look to the needs of the other people. And I think that's what make women relevant sa society. Ako, as my takeaway naman, di, di ako makapagsabi ng perspective, syempre. Uh, pero yung takeaway ko sa mga sinabi nyo, very important is like, for example, talagang social, socially relevant yung mga women. Like for example, meron ng mga nagagawang film about them. Ngayari, yung My Lady Boss. May Lady Boss tama, di ba? Yes. Tapos meron din naman dito sa sinabi ni Ma'am and also kay Ma'am Jenna yung parang may science behind it. Siyempre, sabi nga ni Ma'am, uh, the world will be doomed if women are not existing. Yes. Tama. So alam mo yun, talagang napaka-backbone sila ng social eh. Mm. Ng 
shipping mo from this syempre makakapag-produce yes, pag wala sila. Mm-hmm. Then also, syempre kailangan yung mother natin, napakalaking ano party nila sa buhay natin eh. Kaya isipin mo socially relevant, syempre sumulan natin sa pinakasimula, syempre sa ating mother. Yeah. And yes. Kaya sa mga nanay po namin, no? shout out po, maraming shout maraming salamat. Shout out po salamat. sa mama ko. Actually, she's also give her insight about this. Erlinda Macabeo, shout out, madam. Hello po, ma'am. <laughs> Ayan, partner, no? so dako tayo sa next question. Tanongin naman natin sila sa views about the gender bias rules. Kasi, simulan natin kay ma'am. Oh, sim- simulan natin kay ma'am kasi baka iniisip nila no, na women's celebration, so baka... So, now over na ng women role yung male. So, kailangan lang natin i-clarify or clear out some things. So, ma'am, yeah. take it away po. So, eventually, as you guys mentioned about the the mom, no? Actually, yung mama ko said, stop comparing. We are all same daw, <laughs> sabi ko. <laughs> Nagkagalit na si mama. <laughs> uh, capital, capital lahat. <laughs> Nakakaps lock na. <laughs> so, well, eventually, women can do what men does. But, uh, well, for me, I could say na women can do more um, on a biological perspective. Uh, men cannot conceive, right? So, um, on a professional level, even the management um, agrees that they need women in, in, the, in, the, in corporate as well, in the business. Why? Because women are more passionate, but they have the, the strong will of decision. And at the, end, uh, at the end of the day, they are really caring. Though at times, they are strong because that, that needs to be done. They have a strong decision, but they are more passionate to do it. And of course, no, when... You cannot, as we mentioned, what are their views? Tama ba? Yes, On gender equality? So, yes, or bias role. So, come on guys, we cannot change the world. We cannot change, we cannot change, or we, can, we cannot change others. So, you can only do so by changing yourself. Changing yourself. Be valuable instead of just seeking attention. Earlier, we, we mentioned about um, that word, no? Deserve the credit instead of blaming others or comparing with others. So everyone has strengths and weakness. Focus on your strength instead of be always proving to others. Diba? Always proving to others. That's a key word. Using your weakness and blaming others. Stop feeling like a victim and be account- accountable for whatever you do. Be accountable. So, because the minute you blame, you accept that you are simply powerless or a victim. So, at the end of the day, it's always about you, yourself. Grabe no. Yung, ano, yung word na accountable. Eh, parang, yung sinabi talaga niyo kanina, parang you stand as a woman. Yung kaya mo, yung ano man yung naging pagkakamali mo, yung you stand on it. Kasi accountable ka sa lahat ng kaya mong gawin. Take responsibility. Ikaw, yes. Nila. Kaya, wow. Sobrang powerful yung sinabi ni Ma'am kanina. As in, grabe na mamayin bloom na ako dito. Parang, na-inspired ako sa... Kailangan, syempre, dapat prepared yung susunod ng mga sasagot. Oo, oh, kasi di ba, a standard <laughs> di ba, Rich? Dinigyan na kayo, oh. Like, hello, oh, sinumpa. Pa- <laughs> oh, parang pauwi na ata sila, ma'am. Ayan. Ayan. So, pakinggan naman natin, Ken. Kay, ano, kay Cassandra Ivon. Kay Cassandra Ivon naman natin. Gulat siya, eh. <laughs> Ayan. So, paki... <laughs> Go. <laughs> Pakikat na lang. <laughs> Go, Cassandra. So, well, on the gender bias rules, we all know naman kung paano dinidictate before ang mga women. And, well, on our society naman and on our gender, hindi na siya ganon na masyadong napag-uusapan kasi mas, na, mas napo, napapamunuan tayo ng mga babae. And nakikita naman natin yon And also, for the last election, we all know naman kung paano talagang nanindigan, di ba? The only women na tumakwa sa president. Then, also on the gender bias, para kasing ang cliche niya ng pakinggan kapag hindi, ka, hindi mo binigyan ng 
ng isang pagkakataon yung babae. Lalo na't kung alam naman natin na she is qualified dun sa position na uh, maaari niyang makuha, ba? Diba? And also, siguro uh, oras na rin para uh, maging mulat tayo, even the young people na kaya tayong pamunuan ng mga kababaihan or even the bisexuals. So, ayan. Ayan. So, maraming maraming salamat, Kakay, no? Um, paninindigan, no? Lalong-lalo na if the women is qualified, sabi nga niya, no? why don't no, you just give the opportunity? Next naman is kay Miss Jen. Yes, Miss so, Jen. So, what are their view on gender bias role? So, sa generation kasi natin ngayon, napapansin ko, hindi na siya victim. Eh, natutuwa din ako as well as a maritime industry. Like, dati kasi, nung mga parang gusto ko palang pumasok, parang pinipigilan ako ng parents ko kasi walang opportunity ang babae dyan since ang maritime is very masculine. But ngayon, sobrang natutuwa ako kasi nang ngayon andito ako. Ang naririnig natin is babae ang nagtatap at nag excel So, tuwan-tuwa lang ako na ang daming opportunity, opportunity na for women sa maritime industry since nasabi na nila yung iba't ibang aspect. So, ano nga ba yung takeaway natin, partner, bago tayo mag-shout out? Ha? Ayan, sige, partner, go. Take ako, away. ako muna, ako na muna. Ah, sige, go. Uh, medyo taliwas pala ako sa iyo, ano, Miss ano, Kakay. Kakay. Hindi, kasi, ano nga, tama naman yung term na sinabi niya, na kasi sabi niya lang is, hindi na, hindi na parang napapag-usapan masyado yung sa gender bias role. Pero, pero let's take a look back, be, ano, sa take election. Look. Teka, Ayun yung election. <laughs> Pero election, di ba? Like for example, ang dami kong naririnig na haka-haka, mga opinion nila na sinasabi daw yung we, ano, hindi daw kayang mag, ano, mag, mamuno ng babae. Which is, ayun niya, syempre, as a feminist, ano man, naman. And go for, go ako sa inyo, kung talagang I know naman na kaya nyo, is talagang full support ako. Like for example, yung kay Lenny Robredo na sinasabi na, na kadalasan yung mga matatanda noon, di ba? Hanggang ngayon sinasabi talaga na hindi kaya mamuno ng babae. Like, for example, sinasabi nila, yung, ano, example, medyo, ano, uh, excuse for the word, kunyari, sa menstruation, ano yan, moody yan, mm-hmm. yung hormones niyan, mas makaka-apekto sa decision making. Like, na, I think, irrelevant siya, no, sa, ano na yun, sa sariling decision making ng isang tao. Kaya, I think, is yung gender bias role, talagang ano pa rin siya ngayon about sa mga workplace. I am partner, no? So, ang uh, opinion ko naman about dun sa gender bias role nga, um, sa tingin ko, uh, from the start, no, since I'm a Christian, um, sabi nga, di ba, ginawa ng Lord, ang man and woman, not just to, to dominate uh, one gender to another, pero to, jo- to dominate all the things, lalo na yung create niya sa land, sa water, di ba? So, Ibig sabihin, wala talaga dapat na nag-uungasan na, ay, mas malakas yung ganito, ay, mas malakas yung ganyan. Because I firmly believe that they complement each other. They complement the strengths, they complement, uh, they, they complement each other's weaknesses, kung ano yung kakulangan nito, napupunan ng isa. That's why I think ganun dapat mag-work yung society natin. No? Tulungan, not, um, ayun nga yung purpose din itong Women's uh, Month is to, just to uh, acknowledge na women is, equal as men. So, uh, what we, uh, what men can, siguro, um, kaya i-complement yon ng women. That's why the both uh, gender roles can work ayan talaga, magiging efficient talaga at magiging maayos yung society natin. So, maraming maraming salamat no sa uh, mga opinions nila. Ano mo, bago tayo sumunod sa next question, partner. Actually, actually partner, ito ha. Kumbaga, parang resisto. Oh, uh, actually, kinakabahan talaga. Kasi grabe yung question natin, napakabigatin. Yes. Parang pang Miss Universe talaga to. Di ba? Grabe. Kaya, nilagyan mo rin ng coaching tayo. break. Yes, shout-out tayo. Shout-out muna tayo, partner. Sino gusto mo i-shout-out natin dito, partner? Actually, wala akong gusto i-shout-out, pero may nagbaba-shout-out, partner. <laughs> Ayan, so shout-out po kay Mr. Odon Pasis. Ayan, ang ganun din. Siyempre sa mga team, sa mga team natin. Ayan, maraming maraming salamat, no? Shout-out to you guys. Ayan, kay Jesper, na kumakaway, no? Shout-out sa'yo, Jesper. Shout-out din, din kay, kay Iris Santiago. Nasa kaya siya ngayon? Partner? Ayan, Irish, hello! Happy viewing, Irish! Ayan, so may mga gusto pa kayo shoutout dyan, partner sa YouTube natin? Singit ko lang, shoutout ko, yung, shoutout ko lang yung kapatid ko, nakasabay ko mag-birthday kahap na nakikipag-bebe time kay Poser. Hi! Ayan. Kapatid. <laughs> 
<laughs> ako hindi pa ako dumating sa mga ganyan, ha? Mamaya na sila bardagalin. <laughs> Ayan, man, baka may gusto kayo pa shout out yes. Aside from the... Actually, na shout out of course, um, gusto ko lang din ulit i-shout out sila, no? So, especially to my mama, Erlinda Macabeo. Hi, ma. And my mentors, um, Sandy Martinez of Synergy Family. My mentors, KL Dacera Agustin, Shina Maolyon of Blessing Lives and Building Dreams. My sister, Nicole Fortune. Ma'am Gina Bermudo, maraming maraming salamat po. Doc Risa Caldoza. Um, Ma'am and Sir, Mr. and Mrs. Mary Ann Omega and Sir Noel Omega. Also, my mentor, Sir Noel or and Sir Ace Aguilar. My sister, AJ uh, Rivero and Jill Lasaka. Maraming maraming salamat po. Of course, especially shout out to my amazing children, um, Ryle Stephen John Gamba and Rian Joy Gamba. Actually, also, um, yung, ex, yung um, husband ko was a alumni of 2022. Mm. Pero ano na, um, he passed away. January 2020, pero um, all glory and honor to to my husband. And po, maraming maraming salamat po. Ayan, so yun medyo nakahinga tayo partner, no? Kasi nakapag, oh, nakapag shout out tayo. So Bala, medyo yung, yung test ko. Sibi mo, ba kinakabahan yung mga ano natin dyan? Oo, like, kasi pabigat kasi, ang pabigat. Grabe, ang lakas ni mami. <laughs> <laughs> yung katanungan natin na grabe, paseryoso na lang, paseryoso. Parang, <laughs> Moving on for our fourth question. Grabe, no? Ganun pala talaga pag, ano, pag experience ka na, no? Siguro yung time ko, yung mga time kong ganyan sa inyo, ah. Mga. Pero ngayon, it's it's really glory. Of, oh, all the glory of God. Kaya all this wisdom, no? Yes, bro. Palit tayo. <laughs> Ayan. Ayan. So, diyan dumako na tayo, partner. No, para tapusin na natin yung pagiging intense ng bawat isa dito, partner. Ayan. Dako na tayo sa next question natin. Take it away. Sino sino na muna natin tatanungin ba? Baka kasi magulat na naman eh. <laughs> Sige, si Ma'am Jen naman. Yes. For this fourth question, go. Ten, an, 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 an. When are women most powerful? <laughs> women most powerful when they are themselves with full of confidence. Mapapasabi ko na lang, Uy, ako na to eh. Ganon. Oh. Grabe. Short, no? Pero sweet. Tsaka sobrang powerful, no? Women are most uh, powerful when they are themselves. themselves. Grabe. Uh, Jennifer Martina de Ocampo, 2023. Ako na to. Yeah. Ako na to. <laughs> ako na to. Ako na to. Tapos tuldok na. <laughs> Exclamation. Ako na to. Grabe. Alam, parang tatakbo lang eh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> parang slogan lang. Anyway. Ayan. Next. Kakay, tagbugan mo yung ako na to. Talo ni mo. Kung, Ikaw na yan. Hindi. Kung ano? siya, siya na yan. Si Kakay na to. Oh. Ayan. Mm. May panayim rin. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Kasi, hello. Kakay na to, oh. di ba? Ganun. Well, ayun. When are, when are women most powerful? Once na yung women tumayo na sa higaan niya. That's the best powerful thing. Kasi, every morning, mag, mag-aano muna yan eh. Parang, papakiramdaman niya muna yung sarili niya kung kaya niya bang tum- tumayo at tumindig ngayong araw. Dahil hindi araw-araw, kaya niya tumayo. Pero dahil, like, kaya ako nandito ngayon. That's the most powerful thing that I did today. Just show up. Yeah. No? Ang tumayo sa higaan ko, yun lang. Ganun! Ganun ba siya? Inaan pa ka pa nun, no? Di ba? Inaan pa siya. Wake up, most powerful <laughs> tayo. Ganon. Grabe yun, no? So, pagkabangon, no? Huh! Na- Grabe talaga si Kakay. Pero, I can even share, even online, in the morning, super powerful na magkaroon kayo ng vision. And you know, declare. Mag-declare. Oh, declare na, and gratitude. Kasi, that really made your day right and powerful. Mag-visualize kayo every morning. Father God, thank you for today. You know. Tama yun. Sobrang tama yun. No? Just show so up lang. No? Keep the ball rolling, sabi nga nila. Ayan. So maraming maraming salamat yung kakay na to. Yes. Diba? 2023. Ayan. So kay Ma'am Rich naman. Yes. 
Ayan. So, when are women most powerful? Show your heart. Simply, show your heart. It's all about your heart. And once na your heart works, everything you will conquer. Oh, so, well, eventually, um, not necessarily, kasi there's a quiet norm sa atin, no? Um, being a woman, madaldaal tayo, yung we're always nagging, but that's that's just simply irrelevant on that, you know. But um, we are most powerful when we work with our heart. Ayan. Quote ko na lang to. Kasi when we focus on contributing to others with our heart instead of our mouth, di ba? As everyone and the love of a mother is the biggest ako being a mommy is the biggest influence to the children negative or positive so a woman's weakness can be the mouth yan so taming the tongue ika nga sa ating um, CCF i'm I, i'm i'm a catholic but i'm not really into religion it's all about Jesus Christ. Yeah. It's also it's always about Jesus Christ. So on saying that is all about the heart. Actually, I had a chance to as a mentor. Actually mentor ko tong mga to. Pero they are men. <laughs> they are men. Mentor. Oh, they are they are ano, hindi sila mga babae, mga lalaki tong mga nagsasabi sa akin ng mga ito. So, wala kasi siguro mga Pero feminist din po siguro sila, no. So, ano, um syempre may single na mentor ko. May meron din na kung mentor na may asawa. So, eto, shout out ko din dito kay um Sir Noel Omega. They're they're watching us from LA from California. Hello, hello sir. Yes. So women are most powerful when they nurture life and growth, diba? If memory serves me right, uh based kay Sir Noel, my best teachers, counselors and and mothers were all women. Also women have an innate sense of intuition, diba? It's always about our gut. <laughs> so um that's that's really powerful ha galing na yun sa mga lalaki lalaki <laughs> kumaga parang women instinct na tinatawag po nila oh, yeah. so ito naman um coming from my sister Jennifer Nuya women are most powerful when they stop trying to compare themselves with men so we know that in corporate world um like men earn more for the same job job get promoted faster someone says don't look inside someone else's bowl unless you're checking if he or she has food actually mahaba yon so sinabi niya dito good mothers are instrumental in bringing up outstanding members of the society that's also what doc risa caldoza mentioned so eventually it's always about your heart Kasi kung wala na yung heart mo, patay na tayo. Yun. So, well, eventually that's on on a um, on a physical form, but heart meaning your full potential of being passionate to others as well. Grabe yung partner no. Heart. Yun lang yung sinabi ni Ma'am no. no when uh, when are women most powerful kapag uh, binapakita nila yung heart nila? At to be honest, partner, meron niya ako na buong parang storyline eh, sa empowering women. When Sige, are partner, women? go. Sipi mo, ba? First, waking up, then owning yourself. Ako na to. Then after, show yourself. Be vulnerable sa world. ba? Wake up. Ako na to. Owning yourself, then showing up to the world. Grabe, no? As in... Kapag ka babae ka talaga. Ako na to. Ah, ako si na to. Jen D. Ocampo. <laughs> Ayan, partner, syempre, hello tayo sa California. No, umabot na tayo sa California. Let's go. <laughs> Ayan, so, grabe. Sobrang grabe. Umuulan ng wisdom for this episode, partner. Parang after nito, sobrang inspired na. Pag-isang taon ko na to. Pag-isang taon ko na. 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 Pag-isang taon
Kaya maraming maraming salamat po. Ako rin po. naman, no. Um, it's always, you know, life is always a, a learning process. So, uh, if we stop learning, better, ano yun, put Wait. your your feet six feet underground. Feet underground. <laughs> <laughs> so, ako rin naman, natututo talaga. Ayan, so, we are all lifelong learners talaga dito sa buhay na to. No? We never stop learning. Kaya, ayun, partner, since pahirap na ng pahirap, no? dumako tayo sa last question natin para sa kanila. So, ano yung last question, partner? Ayan, partner. Sino ba unahin natin? Si? Kakay. Unahin natin si Kakay. Okay, Kakay, what do you think is your purpose as a woman? Thank you for that wonderful question. <laughs> okay, magbabalik po ang Mr. and Miss. Okay, chatting. Go. <laughs> well, I believe. Hmm. Hoy! Hoy! Kimi lang, go. Wala akong script. Ang hirap nung tanong. Go lang. Alam kong kayang-kaya mo yan, Kakay. Well, actually, on a daily basis, it was so hard to answer that question. Ano ba yung purpose mo? Not only as a woman, di ba? Parang, ano nga ba yung purpose ko? Siguro, as of the moment, ang purpose ko is to be here. To to be the voice of everyone. Like, the voice kids. <laughs> I want you, ganun. Hindi, <laughs> ayun. To be the voice of everyone. Since hindi naman lahat nabibigyan ng opportunity to voice out yung mga gusto nilang sabihin. And, this kind of platform, it was, uh, it's a very helpful for us para, syempre, ma-promote namin yung sarili namin, namin as an individual. And siguro ayon, yung purpose ko, um, tumula. <laughs> <laughs> yung kami lang. Hindi, ayon, yung purpose ko, syempre, to live life to the fullest. Kasi, Ito na eh, binigay na sa atin yung life na hindi naman natin hiningi pero binigay. So, as much as possible, ibigay natin yung mga kaya natin. And also, lagi nating tatandaan na yung bawat araw is merong dahilan kung bakit natin siya ginagawa. And at the end of the day, merong, meron tayong learnings na, okay, etong araw na to siguro ang ginawa ko lang huminga at magpahinga. Pero meron pa rin reason kung bakit meron na namang bagong bukas. And that's the purpose of, siguro, of me. So, yun, that's all. Thank Ayan. you. <laughs> Ayan, no, maraming maraming salamat. Thank you for the wonderful answer that you yes. have brought us, Miss Cassandra. You're a great singer! <laughs> Charing, iba pala yun, no, karaoke pala yun. <laughs> Ayan, yeah, next so, na. dako naman tayo kay Miss Jen. Um, so, sa tingin niyo po, ano po yung purpose niyo as a woman? So, I think my purpose as a woman is to boost and help someone, a woman, to, para ma-boost lalo yung confidence nila. Kasi I believe when you know your, I, and kapag confident ka, alam mo yung worth mo. And yun yung in advocate ko na know your worth in any ways. So, hindi lang naman para sa babae also, pati din sa LGBTQIA. So, hi din sa inyo. So, be with someone na i-affirm ka na worth it ka and be confident sa araw-araw. Ah, araw-araw. Kanta na yung Ben and Ben. Charing. <laughs> partner. Talaga Asige, yung, partner. Alam, alam mo yun, yung ina-empower talaga nila yung hindi lang si Ling, pero sa iba din. No? Mm-hmm. At saka sa labas din ng greed. Wow. What's greed, partner? It's for you to find out. <laughs> Ayan, partner. No? So, na-share nila Ayan yung na. purpose nila. Mag-ready Eto na. na, guys. Mag-ready na tayo kasi alam natin na uulan talaga ng wisdom. Once na si Ma'am Rich ay, nag- ay nagsagot no? ng kanyang purpose as a woman. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you and thank you, Father God. You know, it's always about um, sharing. Ako, even ngayon, um, shout out to my Blessing Lives and Building Dreams community, my business community, and my Synergy family. You know, guys, it's all about me as a leader, and I, I'm a mommy, and I'm a daughter, diba? I'm a professor, but at the end of all these words, I'm a child, I'm a daughter of God. Um, every morning, I do with my Blessing Lives and Building Dreams community, we have 
a definite main purpose statement every single day. We declare that. So we have actually Zoom at 6 o'clock in the morning. Actually, I, I woke up. I always wake up at 5 a.m. And we started our um, vision, affirmation, gratitude at 6 o'clock saying our definite main purpose statement. Ayan, thankful, grateful with all this wonderful um, community as well. And, ano pa ba? Um, actually, this is yung sabi nung ano ko, yung mentor ko. It's all about daw my heart. Thank you, Mentor Sandy. It's all about your heart and my ability to love. Kasi nga, ba? We know that love conquers all. Ayan. Um, thank you. Uh, actually, ito pa yung sinabi niya. Your inner strength, resilience, the ability to understand others' feelings more. Intuition, the ability to show affection or feelings. Ability to multitask, balancing motherhood, being a wife, being a mom, being a career woman, and... Um, sabi nga, from the Asian Institute of Management in the Philippines, their research shows that the true natural entrepreneurs among Pinoys are the women. Agree kayo doon? Yes, po. So, there are more women who are natural business people than men. So, even a power of I am ni Joel Austin. So, you guys... It really need, it really helps. Yun, the power of I am. I am strong. I am leader. I am a daughter of God. It really helps you as well. Kasi what we affirm in the universe will come true. It's it it's really a matter. And that's really a blessing for me. Ng aking, ano, blessing lives and building dreams community. And synergy family as well. So, well, actually... Later, may i-share din sila, no? So, kasi I believe that women are born to be great. Motherhood is heroic. And women can be the greatest independent entrepreneurs capable of designing our own life instead of settling to be someone's housewife. So, yes. pwede mag-shout out sa live, no? Agree, agree, agree. <laughs> but like anything, you need to deserve it. For those who truly feel that you deserve more and want to do more and want, may Eva flash si, si Joy, no? And want to be a successful woman instead of a housewife, feel free. Yan. Feel free to approach me or connect on FB. I guess our dear friends will show. Yan. Connect on Facebook. Mention that you want, yan, mention that you want to be a successful woman. You can share this to your boss, to your mommy, or to the women that you wanted to bless. So, you, uh, I guess it's already showed. Uh, yes, okay, so connect me. Um, let's connect on Facebook and mention that you want to be a successful woman. So, I know you are from from here from this life yes. okay so i will be glad to help you and be part of your journey to greatness so uh, that's actually connect let's connect on facebook and my blessing lives and building dreams community ayan so yan sabi nga po ni ma'am no uh, mag comment lang kaya sa live section natin kung gusto niyo talaga no maging successful woman syempre tuturu tuturuan kayo tutulungan kayo ni ma'am to become one kasi grabe yung wisdom and experience na senior pa lang sa atin yun ha pero paano pa kaya kung may pakita talaga ni ma'am through her actions may inspire na talaga yung other women alam mo partner hindi, hindi na pa alam, go. hindi naman tayo ngayon sa takeaway tingin ko ang tamang ano natin dito is tamang ending sequence natin for our guest is for you to answer naman ang last question so partner what do you think is your purpose as a woman ayun siguro ay yung purpose ko as a woman ganun yung tingin sa akin ken <laughs> sabi niya ang hirap na doon tanong sabi alam mo <laughs> Sa so, tingin ko kayo, yung purpose ko as a woman, uh, balik lang din ako sa sinabi naman kanina, no, as a Christian, 
Um, yung sa tingin ko talagang purpose sa akin is to, you know, to really share the gospel. But since as a woman, no, I I will do what I can. And siguro um, sabi nga nila, kung hindi mo pa nakikita yung purpose mo ngayon or hindi mo pa alam yung totoong meaning ng life, malalaman mo yon when you serve people, especially when you serve God. And sabi nga naman kanina, yung love, ayun yung pinakamahirap kasi ibigay eh. Kasi may mga tao talaga na syempre, di ba, mahirap mahalin. Mahirap na, ibigay kasi yung wala kay. Ayun, kaya nga sabi nga nila, He first loved us. So, minahal na tayo ng una, kaya sa tingin ko, kayang-kaya natin maibigay yung love na nanggagaling sa kanya. And I think that's the purpose of my life actually, na ayun, to help um, people by serving them. no Kahit siguro, uh, hindi mo isipin yung sarili mo, Sabi nga nila, actually partner ah, ito, hindi ako naniniwala talaga or uh, inaano yung self-love. Kasi ang tinuturo talaga ng Bible or ng scripture is to be selfless. No? Na if you wanted to, um, to love yourself or to know what is the meaning of life, you need to serve people and God. Hindi mo yun makikita na, I'm just protecting myself, I'm just protecting my peace, I'm just protecting you know the love for myself. Pero malalaman mo yun when you serve people. Kasi hindi yun matutumbasan na kahit ano pang bagay at pera dito sa mga. And I, thank you. <laughs> grabe talaga yung mga Grabe talaga yung mga bisita gusto natin yun eh, no? Support, ha? Actually gusto ko rin yun i-support kasi the Bible did not say compare with others. It says love others and all things give thanks, di ba? So we can even share this about empowered woman si um Ofra, si Ofra Winfrey, di ba? Um, be thankful for what you have. So you'll end up having more. If you concentrate on what you don't have, you will never ever have enough. So, grab this. Eventually, it, it really, on, in short, no? Be inspirational. Yes. Be really infer- inspirational. The world doesn't need more talkers. <laughs> they need more doers and who can inspire. So, we know this. The world is not unfair to us, to women. And you can choose to see it that way because we want to empower ourselves not to blame, to make excuses, or to be a victim. Ayan. So, grabe. But really, and the empowerment begins within us. See ourselves as valuable and equally important. So, be accountable for our results. <laughs> Talaga. So later, kung na siguro ito i-share, no? Sinabi nga rin natin, no? In 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 33, do not be misled. Bad company corrupts good character. Bad company corrupts. Grabe. And it's, um, later ko na lang siguro i-share yung key to success, no? And, yeah. nag-support lang din ako yes, mahal po, doon sa sinabi Thank niya. you po, ma'am. And yun, Ken, so ibabalik ko naman sa yo yung question. So, sa tingin mo, no, um, what is your purpose lang? Uh, a purpose, no? As since pinag-uusapan na natin, yung sabi nga ni ma'am, no, live a purposeful life. No, syempre, paano, ano ba yung fuel mo to, sabi nga ni Kaka, to show up, to wake up, ano ba yung fuel mo? So, ano yung purpose mo? Sa <laughs> ngayon, Ken, o, oh, di ba, nahirapan rin si Ken? <laughs> Kala mo ako na ba? Hindi ko na tinanong. Bakit to yung Ken, syempre. Napalibutan ako eh. <laughs> Go Ken. Walang taas. Yan. Pero so, ano ulit yung question? <laughs> so, ano yung purpose mo? As a man. Sige. As a as, man. As a human na lang. As a you, sige, as a human. Go. Siguro yung purpose ko na lang as a person is also, like from what you have all said earlier, is to give, ano, to influence others. Hindi lang kasi umiikot yung mundo sa iyo eh. Alam mo yon. So you have all you have also to you have also you also need to understand others. Hindi lang kasi umiikot yung bu- buhay sa iyo. So you have to learn, share and also feel what it feels like to be them. To be able to grasp the situation itself. No, kasi kapag nakapagbigay ka na is parang tol nga nang sabi mo is parang doon mo malalaman as a person kung ano talaga yung purpose mo by giving others yes. on what you have and what you can offer to the world. Ayan. So, maraming maraming salamat Let's po. No? Um, baka po may mga gusto pa po kayong ipahabol, ipashoutout po. Um, start tayo kay Kakay. May, may gusto kang ipashoutout. 
Shout out po sa Kompas. Woo! Woo! Let's go team! Kita kit sa next live. Eme. Ayan. Surprise! <laughs> go kay Ma'am Jen. So, shout out ko lang yung student council officer. Ang ganda po nung regalo niya sa akin. Nag-isa po ako naka-duty. <laughs> Ayan, kay Ma'am Rich. Um, well, basically, basically, this is all about Uh, keys to success na lang. No? Yes, I don't really want to miss this. Um, sure, especially with coming from my dearest mentor. Grabe to. As in, um, earlier, I, I cried and I praised God having this person all around me. So, keys to success. Number one, be grateful. Always and focus on improving us, yourself. It's like a muscle. Number two, invest in yourself. Grow yourself and the results will follow. Number three, be excellent. Even as a wife, a mother, a cook, make it your brand. That whatever you do, you do it excellently. Diba? Work as unto the Lord. Based on our Colossians, um, verse 3, chapter 23, work. Willingly at whatever you do, as yes. though you were working for, for the, the Lord, Lord yes. rather than for people. Number four, in life, you either, you either get results or excuses, but never both. Okay? There's no such thing as a really rich victim. Rich gamba meron. Totoo yun. <laughs> Number five, find a platform that will allow you to fulfill your potential and challenge you to be better. And even earn better at the end of the day. That's one thing to glorify our God as well. It's okay to receive, receive help from others, but better to be helping others instead. Number six, find an empowering support system that will empower you, environment. Sometimes it's stronger than your, will, your own willpower. Diba? Yes, po. Marami tayong naririnig dyan. Iba talaga pag may support system ka Yes, po. exactly. And if you need help and feel you want to be more and do more, connect, as we mentioned, uh, connect me. Let's connect via Facebook. I will try to help and message me saying, this is the one, I want to be successful woman. And I will do my best to help you. So... That's the key word. So, I would know na yung mga nag-message sa akin eh, ay galing dito. Nanood yes. dito. They can, they can share it by heart, sa mommies, or whoever they, they wanted to share this blessing. So, don't forget. I want to be a successful woman. Let's connect on Facebook. Ayan po. So, if a flash po ng team namin, yung Facebook page or Facebook um, account ni Ma'am Rich. And then you can reach her out, syempre, and by saying, no, I want to be a successful woman. Ayan. So, you can share din, din po yung live na to or yung clip lang, no, yung key to success ni Ma'am, no, sobrang inspiring talaga noon. Ayan. So, maraming maraming salamat, Ma'am Rich. Sobra grabe po yung time. And grabe yung presence pa lang ni Ma'am Rich. Grabe. Iba yung Iba yung tindeg, iba yung confidence na nanggagaling talaga sa powerful woman. And Glory to God yan, coming from him. Pero yes. alam mo, partner, ha? hindi lang si Ma'am Rich lang ang kailangan natin palakpakan. Yes. Guys, palakpakan naman natin yung uh, guess natin lahat. Not only them, not only them, but also all women. Yes, ayan. So happy Women's Month po sa inyong lahat. Ayan, so maraming maraming salamat po for your time. Salamat po, ma'am. Maraming maraming salamat po. And now, for more upcoming events na dapat nyong abangan, we have... <laughs> Ayan! So, we have... The, the latest! latest! Thank you, Mom. Oh, tapos na. May 6 o'clock naman ako. Maraming salamat. Thank congrats, you, ha. Congrats, mahal. The latest partner is over. Let's practice tayo. Okay, one, two, two three, three, go. The, the latest. latest. Grabe naman kasi yung lag natin. Ano pang abang mga magaganap sa susunod na araw, partner? 
Ayan, partner, kaya naman, here are the following news and activities. Kaya naman, Irish, ibaba mo na yan. Now, let's run forward. Let's embark to a new information. Sailing with flying colors of anticipation. Taasay Saran is once again back. Mas bigger, bolder, and, and better. better. Roll BDR or may flush ba tayo? In celebration of the 29th foundation anniversary of the Asian Institute of Maritime Studies, the Special Initiatives Office, in coordination with the PCGA 129th Squadron, is holding the Saran 7 Color Marino Challenge Act 2, the Amazing Color Blast, on 18th of March at the CCP Ground Complex, Pasay City. Ayan, partner with Inflatable Obstacle. That will challenge your strength and senses. That's why, guys, we are hoping for everyone to participate. Not only the students, but as well as the employees. We Not only as the employees, with the support of the alumni, PCGA officers, and some hobbyists. Yes, partner. So next on the list, we have Miss Nicole Primero and Miss Jomel Era. From the Ames School of Heritage Education for their Gawad Buhay nomination for Best Choreography. Miss Nicole is nominated for her work on Pepas Under My Skin, while Miss Jomel was recognized for Decada Sesenta by Barefoot Theater Collaborative. Now on its 13th year, Gawad Buhay is the first ever industry award exclusively for the performing uh, arts juried by an independent panel of critics, scholars, artists, and theater enthusiasts. Congratulations, Congratulations Ms. Nicole, Nicole and Ms. Jamel. Your Ames family is so proud of you. Grabe yun. Hindi lang talaga matatalino ang mga ancients. Kundi talented din, partner, no? Tama ka dyan, partner. If you can recall, Irish, and the institution cred of Ames is that we don't just accept the smart, intelligent, and resilient students. We help them become. Yes. Very well said, partner. Kaya naman, this is to inform you guys na ang ating enrollment are still ongoing until 1st of April 2023 for third trimester. Tumpak ka dyan, Ken. Kaya naman, don't get me wrong, ha? Uh, I don't want to spoil, syempre, yung fun ng same break natin. Pero ito yung, uh, just, I just want to remind everyone na start na po ng ating third trimester is on 27th of March, 2023. So, ilang araw na lang din pala halos, no? So, two weeks of same break, then now, resume na ulit. Yes, partner. Syempre, bakbaka na ulit tayo and focus na ulit tayo sa goal natin. Yes, kaya naman, stay tuned for our next live para sa mga news and activities na dapat abangan ng mga Imshans. Enjoy your pahinga, Imshans! Grabe, partner. Kulang talaga ang oras, lalo na ang dami nating pinagsaluhan at grabe yung wisdom ng mga guests natin kanina. Yes, talagang napuno talaga ako ng wisdom eh. Like, di na ako mag ano eh, maghahaponan eh. Ako nga din eh, parang laki na nang galing. <laughs> Ayan, partner! Uh, ayun na, ito na yung mga pinag-in... Ihihintay ng mga ano natin, live viewers. Yeah, sabi nga, sabi ni Irish Alicod. Gumaganan si Irish Alicod. Partner, go! At para naman sa ating mga winners, eh, congratulations to our first winner for the first question, Miss Michi Buman Azanet Espina ng 32A3. Klasik ko pala to. <laughs> Ayan, no, syempre, Para naman sa ating second winner from MT22 A3, wow, A3 then partner, uh, Midshipman Odon Passes. So, ayan, so congratulations po no, so, sa lahat ng mga winners natin. Um, get in touch lang po sa SESD office, no? makikita niyo po siya or matatagpuan niyo yung SESD office sa 3rd Deck Ames Tower. Ayan. So, please follow our social medias, guys. Follow the Ames official Facebook page and Ames Student Council. Ganun din yung the Baywatch Facebook page. 
Ayan. And also, don't forget to follow our social pla social media platform. We have the Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, kung saan tayo live ngayon, partner. And, and subscribe, subscribe for, for more, more updates. updates. Wait, partner. Nakakalungkot man sabihin, but... <laughs> Charing. Okay, ayan, part partners. Siyempre, eh, gusto ko lang naman i-inform everyone sa ating mga live audience at uh, sa ating mga Compass team. Eh, talagang ano, uh, si, ano, ang aking partner na si Dana ay ano partner? Pa, hindi pa. <laughs> Ayan, so maglilib na, I mean, ah, panandalian, no? Panandalian. Panandalian. Yes. Yeah. Ay, actually, aalis. Ah, oh, panandalian, Talaga. sabi niya noona, di ba? Ayan, no? So, um, I will, syempre, grabe na yung wisdom. Sabi ko nga kanina, di ba? Punong-puno na yung wisdom na nakuha ko. So, parang sa tingin ko, sobrang um, jump back na jump back na ako. Ready-ready na ako. Naggawin yon no? Um, it turn into actions. Yung mga nakuha ko at napulot ko mga wisdoms. Siyempre, not just only for this episode. Siyempre, sa mga past episode natin. Partner. So, so in, sum in summary, Ayan, uh, no? this will be your last ano, episode. Yes, so this will be my last no uh, episode together with the team. Ayan, so maraming maraming salamat syempre sa mga naging guests natin for the past episodes, sa mga wisdoms and experience nila. Syempre, sa mga um, nakukuha din nating learnings from the team. Ayan, so maraming maraming salamat. Well, partner, syempre meron din dapat akong ano, say, syempre. Syempre, so, ikaw na yan eh. Ikaw ako ba talo? Hello. Kala mo, may miss kita. <laughs> Go, Ken. Ano well, sa mo? partner, it's been, a, it's been a swell ride with you having you as my back as a, as my partner as well like talagang to be honest na enjoy ko talaga yung the compass dahil hindi hindi lang dahil sa pagla-live sa mga pag duty talagang dahil din sa your partner talagang every time magkasama kasi tayo talaga alam mo yun vibe bigay na bigay <laughs> talagang like legit ano ah guys talagang tatawa lang ako nang tatawa basta makita ko nga lang tatawa na ako tingnan mo naman itsura nito oh, oh? Oh, Ay, nako. Dinodog show ako hanggang sa huling Baka pagkakataon. Ito na, kasi, ito na kasi yung last na dog show, eh, guys. Ayan, Ken. Pero yun, maraming maraming salamat talaga. Siyempre, sa'yo, Ken. Kaya naging smooth sailing lang din yung journey natin together with the team. Siyempre, sobrang um, cooperative talaga ng lahat and sobrang fun to work with them. Baka may gusto kong pasalamatan. Alam ko, meron ka atang ano, eh. Ayan, no. Siyempre, in connection with the celebration of the Women's Month, no, gusto ko lang i-shout out ng formally um, yung lola ko. No, si Lola Melodia Suarez and sa lolo ko, Tatay Andres Suarez, sa mama ko, no, and syempre sa tita ko and sobrang grabe kasi no, yung turning into adulthood, nakikita ko talaga on how women um dinadala no, paano nila bitbitin yung problema and they are so strong. So, kudos sa mga family members ko and ayun, maraming maraming salamat. So, shout out sa inyo. Ayan. Ah, gusto ko pasalamatan. Ayan, so maraming maraming salamat. Yung cake na nagbab nagbigay sa akin na from the compass. Baka gusto mo kunin para mapakita natin, Ken. Di ba? Ayaw. Ito na ako. <laughs> Baka maubos Ayan. ko agad. Well, Ayan nga, Ken. Alam mo, so, partner. So, let's, let us introduce our next live yes! host. Ayan, partner. Tara, partner. Next partner. Ayan, no? Para introduce natin yung next partner ni Ken, we have here our... Dito ka, dito, dito, dito. Rider and slash host. So ganito ang mangyayari, ah, practice tayo. This is ano ano Michi Man Ken Salasa. This is ano 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 man. Sabay tayo sa Sir sa ready to serve. Ready to serve. Yan. So ready ka na ba, partner? Gina G. Yon. So ayan. This is Michi Man Ken Salasa. And this is Michi Puman Dana Bereño. And this is Midship Woman, Cassandra Ortega. <laughs> naging Midship Woman! Naging Midship Woman! Hoy, nagbalit ka ng first woman! Hindi pa po siya boy. ready as my partner, I think. Ola, CA po siya, CA! Go, go, go. This is Midship Woman, Ken Salasa. This is Midship Woman, Dana Bereño. And this is Cassandra Yvonne Ortega. Ready, ready to, to serve Asians with all our hearts! Ayan! So maraming maraming salamat sa team naman and even sa advisor naman, Miss Miami Ebelane. Ayan, kay Ma'am Joy din, no, shout out. Kay Sir Ron, maraming maraming salamat po. Ayan, partner, take it away. The floor is yours para sa ating quote of the day as a woman yourself. Ayan, thank you, partner. No, And as Miss Simone de Babois said, one is not born a woman, one becomes one. Wow. Ayan, kaya yeah. samahan nyo. 
Aming muli. Sinakay muli and let's have a experience, experience games. games.